Yeah, yeah. doing a good job, making sure this top hard camp is blocked. Oh, well, here's try the sleep. I mean, Collapse has hit the level three. Let's see if he's got enough lockdown and damage to take this. Kellen, yes, he does. At the same time in the mid lane, Toronto, Tokyo. Very low there. Again, great presence of mind. You can tell why these players are in the Grand Finals. They're not giving anything away for free. It's not like neither team's attempting to make moves. It's just both teams are really on top of it, as mid. The set up here with a combo. Nice dodge. Flies off to the side here, Toronto, Tokyo. In fact, and over in the triangle, they are able to catch it. They get lane control up top, and immediately when they get it, they have the opportunity to pressure the tiny. Radiant so, force them off the wave, two. force them to go into the jungle, and he doesn't have any sustain, right? So, he's gonna have to spend gold on the next region. They're going for him early on here with the three of them surrounding the terrible oh. Yutoro. He's trapped in the trees. The moves from the supporters of PSG OGD start to come in. See the counter play attempted. Set up with the Nightmare, but a TP's already coming over for nothing to say. He'll be ready to fight if Team Spirit push any further, and they won't. They'll respect the potential of a backup. He moves as PSG OGD do start to, to slowly ramp up and a, an early gold advantage. Now heading the 1k lead, they'll be able to catch themselves. A lonely vein in the river, Mira. Area of the map. See in the mid lane. Over for the catch, but again, Toronto Tokyo fully prepared. Yeah, well Spirit, the way. Spirit are aware that the boat was used, and that means the top tower is very unlikely to be defended. It's hard for them to get on top of Army. Again, playing smart with the Avalanche, putting a stop to the combo, and now time's been bought for PSG LGD to come around. Yatoro immediately out with the TP. Doesn't want to be around there anymore. Mira will get found in the trees, though. Another death there on the vein as PSG LGD continue to fight back. And two, two for, for 400 HP, he's got the, the Echo Saber, the Tread. See if they can do it. Nightmare set up, instantly TPs are coming in. See if they can do the damage quick enough, Yutoro focusing down with the Metamorphosis and the Illusions, they'll be able to take it, they kill off Arme. As Declare's coming in, but Yatoro is able to sidestep it. PSG LGD, can they get a grab in return? Nothing to say, trying to charge in. See Mira head into the trees, trying to distract them from the rest of them, but here comes the Micro. From wide, nice. he's able to lock down Maposhka here with a setup from the center. Drag back into the combo. He'll try his best to break the combo. Nothing to say here with a curse from for LGD. But Yatora has the space that he wants. Can they get a grab underneath the tier two tower? Jin Q, nothing to say. They're going to try. Collapse. He's going to go with the RP just onto Jin Q. Drag the sky up underneath the tower. It will lose the wide in return, but Yatora is ready to turn up the grips there. They've caught nothing to say underneath the tower. Yatora's bit this arm for now, though. Slider Fist comes out and they're looking to turn on another. Faith Beyond, but of course that will also get claimed by Yatora, some more money. Radiance yeah, Faith Beyond's about a thousand gold away from the Ags. Perhaps, it's about one toss, he's got that set up. Quick catch and a drag back on as Q gets him in reach of the rest of the team. They've got to watch out for these pickoffs. So something that Collapse was tearing them apart with earlier in the series. See how Team Spirit want to tackle this. There's a DD on the Looking for Collapse, he's in, instantly caught up by the Ancient Seal. So no skewer to follow. Why? Change back up. In searing heat. Is there anything they can do to save their Enchantress? I mean, does why need saving at all? He, he, he's going to need to. As a nightmare holds him back. Yeah, well. I mean, you know the Team Spirit's got the solid jump, but PSG, they've got the hard hit. Right, if they can get it. With the tiny ball, you're going to see Collapse come in. He's in with the horn toss, he's going to look to separate. Nothing to say for the rest of the team. P and Fiend Scrib as well, locking down the Kunkka. They get a quick grab, nothing to say, out for a minute. Jumped away from the stun of the tiny. Radiant spot. The fortifications seem to be coming to an end. You see Spirit, they're happy to go for the dives behind the tower. The Toronto Tokyo is in, and he's found himself a Jin Q. Great recognition there. You know, Tiny initiates on your top. What does that mean? That means there's no hero mid to fight. Team is slowly swinging into Team Spirit's favor, and they're kind of getting past that impossible timing of fighting this Tiny. Or collapse. He's got another grab. Jumps in wide. He's gone. Get map control that way. And you know, with these illusions pushing safely, enforcers. Oh! He looks for the jump of collapse. He's not able to get the grab back. What nothing to say? So nothing to say. Peek him. He's up a mirror. Holding him for the leg of the peek. He gets cancelled by the Avalanche. The Winter's Curse coming to a quick end. Charging out the base, Pokos crashing down onto Mira. Ancient Seal for now onto Yatoro, so gonna back up and reset inside the base. Toronto Tokyo, he's diving in, past the tier threes, he's able to take out nothing to say. Looking around and over to the side, he's got his eyes over towards Y. 
maybe even more actually he's holding on to that not jumping back quite yet as they've killed off two and with two dead they may just have to room in and push up to the high ground Yatoro is stepping up still a bit longer with the metamorphosis left they're taking this tier 3 tower there's going to have to be buybacks Jin Q back into the game but a tier 3 taken here some damage being done to the Rex as well no Kunkka for 40 seconds yeah and no wolf fight he finds a grab jumps in drags back on the sky Q. He's gone for 70. Another man down on PSG LGD. He's fast. That will keep the push going. And you've got to be careful. You know, Collapse is looking for another one. There it is. He's in. Drag back on wall. He just can't stop finding them, Collapse. But the buildings. They do not seem afraid. There's so much confidence right now in how they're playing. They get the buyback. He's the next mark, but he's 3,000 HP. Oh, so tacky. Sunder, Satanic at the ready if he ever feels threatened. But look at this. LGD are coming in from behind. They recognize that they can't go on the front line. They need to catch the backline heroes. They're going to try and go for the easy kill first, or at least the, the easier, maybe. But no, it's not. TP out there, oh, but they stop it. Arme's in with the combo. They catch the Bane. They need more, though, nothing to say in the team. Doesn't look like they're going to get it. Meposhka's off into the trees. They won't be able to find him to stop that escape. Yeah, absolutely. And it's reflected in the way that Alm is playing. But he's about to get caught here. Let's collapse. In with the horn toss. Dropping the RP. The BKB was out in time. He's into the invis. For the physical. Is it going to be enough here on this terror blade? Yatora is focusing down Alm. I don't think they have enough time to wait for Tiny to respawn. See how careful these Team Spirit play it. Goes back. There's still 20 seconds now, are they? They can push. They can push it, Spirit. They don't need a back. 20 seconds with that, are they? They're going to look for more ground for play closing up. Jump off for Galant. Shin Chi goes down. Nothing to say as well. AJ Boy, nothing to say on the buyback. Eight seconds until Arme. To reset spirit. We're trying to get out faith beyond on top of the other. Stick for the curse. Holding about the lichen. Why? Being a bit of a nuisance off to the side. Impetus on Demira, but why? It's chased down by Kalanzi, you sort of got him. Toronto Tokyo, long mana. Chase, holds it back, but now with a BKB armor. He has no stop. Straight back in with the runner. Gets instantly caught out with the torrent. The silence as well. Jump on. Collapse. BKB. Still back. Let's see what they can do around this pit. They're still down 16k PSG. I can even look at all their ults up. Can they make any sort of steal? They've already managed to set up here. On to the Kunkka. They're going to go straight to Wakey Tower. Put him the BKB. The curse. Hawks back on on the side. Nothing to say. He's going to go down. Out for 110. Yatoro is ready to step up in his next song. He's looking over towards Arlen. Collapse. Hop in the BKB. And Maposhka keeping himself alive with the cold embrace. Spirit. The turn over towards Arlen. Oh, he's looking at the BKB. He's gone. He's killed off another support. He's looking at Toronto Tokyo. Toronto Tokyo. This into the remnant of the high ground. He's away. Why? He's off on the cliff. Why? Dude, look at how carefully they're playing it. They're scared to walk up there and try to kill him. <laughs> Watch, like. Oh, they got him. There we go. Take him off the cliff. But look at Rose. Oh, oh he's killing Rose. Oh, no, he can't do it, surely. Link out on collapse. He's got his eyes on him. He's still no, nothing to say. All white for 50 seconds. Alone. He's gone in alone. That was a risky move. He's got the back of a Jin Q. for the creeps. They're ready to close it this time. Only two left. Can they stop the PSG? I don't think they can. Jinky's got it over. Jinky, it's over. Jinky, it's over. 
Come on. 